What's going on y'all? About to go fishing. Got my boy Nate. So unfortunate. The boat 101. We're gonna go fishing. We're gonna meet Carrie. Gotta fill up the ice chest. So we'll see y'all at the pond. Update on life. Me and Nate are not good with directions. We forget. Well, I mean, we kind of knew, but we didn't know because we I thought we were supposed to turn right. Because I said, road. yeah, we you both said, said left, and then we got there, and it's like, no, this has got to be right because it looked better going right. You second guess, yeah. I second guess. My fault. I should have just went with my gut. You second guess and said, no, it's got to be. It's probably left, and I was like, I think it's right. And you listen to me because I know could have been here. I've been here back whenever I was like eight. <laughs> I'm 21 now, so. We ain't been here in probably, what, two years? Well, we, we, we came here last year, but... I we did? did? Yeah, we did. Oh. It was back when it was like, the water was real low. Yeah. But it was like... So let's just hope that Carrie is not just sitting there waiting. Oh, man. We'll find this sucker, though. We're going to find the pond if I don't wreck us. If I don't wreck us. We done got past. And then we waved at some lady, and she didn't wave back. This is... I'm videoing off my iPhone, too, because I forgot my big camera. So I don't know how well this is working. We're in Calvin. Working. Okay. <laughs> We're in Calvin. I, I remember from my high school days, back when I shot and missed every shot in one game I played in Calvin. No, no I made one. No, game. you made some shots. I remember somebody talking about it. Or was it? That was in Quitman. Yeah, you made tournament. Yeah. Quitman tournament against Dotson. I hit four threes, didn't miss one, but 100 percent from the combined three point line. 12 points. The only time I ever played, really. Nice. In high school. And, yeah, they were like, yeah, Nate, you won us the game. I'm like, we were up by 25, so how? Yeah, but, no, when we did play at Calvin, though, um, we played Atlanta, and that was, like, a really good team. and only hit one three. So, I don't know why you let me go on about this basketball stuff when we're going fishing, but. Let's go rip some lips, sonny. Yeah. They've made it. And I've done caught three fish, haven't recorded any of it. So that's that's just wonderful. Oh man, let's see. I'm trying to get Carrie the GoPro. She looked like she was trying to fight her. <laughs> oh, that's pretty good broom right there. <laughs> Pick it out! <laughs> so what now? Oh, there we go. 
get it off the hook. So we ain't really caught that many bass, just a couple little dinks, you know, 10 inches long maybe. Uh, Brooks caught some brim, so we're going to rig up a catfish pole and see if we can't catch some catfish in this pond. Alright, rigged up for catfish. Forgot my cork. My brook hadn't caught any more brim. So, kind of slacking. So what we try to promote on this channel is how easy it is to get in outdoors and stuff and uh, as me and Brooke was talking on the way over here, you know, state of Louisiana, you don't have to have a fishing license to fish on a private land. So, I mean, that's as easy as it gets. I mean, you can go down to Walmart and pick you up a brim pole, a couple hooks and sinkers and corks and some crickets and get out on a private pond somewhere and catch fish. I mean, it's, it's that easy. Um, and of course, I mean, there's more to it uh, if you want to get more in depth fishing, but it's really that simple. So if you know some private ponds, people that's got private ponds and you want to try out fishing, uh, just head down to Walmart, get you a, a brim pole, some sinkers, corks, and some hooks, and some crickets, and you're set to go. So.